going on if you're cockeyed, find a man who had a stroke, goddammit. That's right, you cockeyed, he sideways, y'all the perfect goddamn couple. What? Shit. We can't trip no more. Know that you are beautiful. I don't give a damn what. Understand it. You know what happened? We start getting tricked by these magazines and these television. These bitches is trip tricking you. You think you can live up to them celebrity bitches, don't you? Well, it can't happen because the hoes ain't real. You know, they build them bitches, you know that. Buying titties, which I don't understand. Why you gonna buy titties when you got socks at home? <laughs> Ladies, these hoes are not made out of the same stuff you made out of. You a real woman, them bitches are not. They there to entertain your ass. You know they ain't made out of your shit because you read about them going to the hospital for shit like exhaustion and dehydration. Now, what bitch you know so tired she gotta go to the hospital? I know some exhausted bitches. I know some women got two jobs, six kids, no man, the bitch got things to do. You hear me? She gotta go to PTA meetings after school programs, football practice, riverboat casino, this bitch is exhausted. She ain't going to no hospital. She can't, who gonna watch them bad ass children when she goes? In the real world, when you get exhausted, you take a fucking nap, don't you? You stop letting them bitches trick you, cause they will trick you, and they use your kids to trick you. You see these commercials where they got kids now trying to fuck with your self-esteem. But it's all about attitude. I saw this one Jenny Craig commercial, this woman comes out there all distraught and fucked up, talking about, I knew I had to do something. Because I woke up one morning and my daughter said, Mommy, you're fat. <laughs> and I knew I had to do something. So I picked up that phone and I called Jenny Craig. You know, they flipped the screen, she come back like two weeks later. I lost 15 pounds on Jenny Craig and I feel great. I say, yeah, that's good, bitch, but you need a new attitude. Because had that been me on that commercial, it would have went the same way with a different attitude. I'd have said, well, I knew I had to do something because I woke up one morning and my daughter said, Mommy, you're fat. And I knew I had to do something. <laughs> so I picked up that phone and I knocked that little bitch down the flight of stairs. <laughs> I whooped her little ass that day. Told her, you the reason why mama's so fucking fat. Can your little bald head ass around for nine months. I beat her so long, I lost 15 pounds, and now I feel good. <laughs>